All right, guys, pre-workout coming right at you. Uh, Redcon's Total War, the uh, bombsicle or the rocket bomb is the flavor that we're using. Uh, we've been using this for the last uh, week or so. It's supposed to be a 15 serving, so I don't, I don't know. Maybe they say it's 15, but it's actually 30. But, like, I've been using it pretty consistently uh, if I'm not using their pump product, the big noise pump. If I'm not using this, I'm using that, uh, but... It's so lasted me a long time, uh, but we're back in the car. It seems you guys are enjoying these types of videos. Uh, I have a little tripod set up so the camera's just a little bit farther away and a better at a better height. So hopefully you enjoy uh, just that little bit of energy I put into making it look good. Uh, somewhat freshly shaved, so I feel good. I feel ready to attack this day. This is day two of my three-day break between cycles. So if you don't know this new job I have uh it's brutal uh we're here in camp parks just outside san francisco and uh, we work 23 days straight and then typically you have around like two or three weeks off uh, and then you do it again uh this cycle is very interesting it being my second third third official cycle uh we're doing uh one cycle and then three days off and then another cycle so it's like 46 days in a row with a three-day break um pretty much so a little brutal a little brutal but we're, we're gonna make it through uh today we're gonna be hitting some chest um i've been really enjoying the exercises we've been doing uh the journal needs to be more consistent so i do apologize for that uh if that's something you guys want to see is my actual journaling uh where i actually write down my exercises and my reps and my weights uh let me know in the comment section below uh, i can definitely uh, continue doing that more often uh, the last time we logged was may 2nd so it's been it's been a couple weeks so today we're gonna do uh chest we're gonna use that free motion fly machine we really like that one uh you'll see everything in the footage because you seem to enjoy that as well uh we're gonna do uh, more incline chest but not so much to be shoulders because i want to be able to actually hit shoulders separately um so today's chest tomorrow will be back and then shoulders and then legs so uh that's kind of how i want to do my splits right now four days uh minimum a week four days minimum a week if i can throw in an extra um an extra chest or an extra back day i try to do uh different types of pulling uh maybe like pulling from the ground or um some lat pull downs or uh, some pullovers for back for um for chest i'll do either like an upper chest dominant day or a lower chest dominant day uh, with the fly machine with the free motion fly machine we like to do uh either like a, a, a level fly where we're hitting the chest more like uh upper mid more like holistically hitting the whole chest pectoral muscle um, but if we're hitting that decline day there's a free motion machine that the handles are at the ground that people use for like curls and shoulder press uh, we're going to do that we're also going to use uh, that free motion shoulder press machine for shoulders so i'm excited to try that out it looks like a lot of fun so i'm excited to try that out uh, i want to hit at least one big movement today that has a lot of um uh, focus on the chest where it's uh, really going to isolate it really going to destroy it uh, pushing the weight so that's going to be my uh, second main focus today. Uh, of course, when it comes to those flies, I always feel the most for my chest development when I do those flies, when I do those heavy, slow, deep, uh, controlled flies. So th those are my main focuses today, is hitting a upper, maybe flat uh, chest press machine, uh, heavy weight for at least two working sets, kind of the JP uh, style training uh that philosophy and then with the flies we usually go uh all, all, quite a bit higher in reps we'll do like 15 to 20 uh for reps uh at heavy weight so that's what you're going to be uh, seeing soon hopefully you enjoy the footage i'll throw it on the screen for you um but besides that um we're we're still rocking redcon one for this season so uh we got the total war and then the big noise sometimes we take if uh it's a little later in the day and i, I want to work out but I can't afford the stimulants. So we're just about done with this one. We've got just a bit, little bit left. Flavor is amazing. Lips are tingling. I'm ready to go. We waited in at 2.41 this morning. Uh, let's see what we look like at the end of the day. So I hope you enjoy the footage. I'll throw it on the screen, and I'll see you guys post-workout.
All right, guys. Wow. Um, great workout. Uh, probably one of the best chest workouts I've had so far. Uh, did a lot of the, um, you know, when, when you when you get in the gym, sometimes you gotta work, use the equipment that's available. And uh, today, there's only specific equipment available. So uh, we actually swapped out the incline machine press for the decline machine press because it was available. Uh, so, you know, we're still still making chest gains, but uh, not what we wanted today. Uh, we were able to immediately after that hop right into the incline machine. So uh, we did two plates on that. We did three plates on the decline. Uh, I have it all outlined in the note journal. Um, didn't do a lot of journaling. I'll fill in the rest of it, but uh, for the easy bar tri push downs, they didn't even have an easy bar that clipped onto the cable machine, so couldn't do that. Single arm tricep extensions, uh, you saw in the footage, was great. Uh, really was able to get a, a great contraction doing those movements. And then uh, we skipped out on the hammer chest press. Uh, they didn't have one. And if they did, it wasn't available because I didn't see it. Um, and then we did some posing. So the normal yoga room that I like to do my posing in was occupied. So I used the bicycle room, the um, cycle room. And uh, if I turn on the flashlight, as you can see here, if I turn on the flashlight on my camera, the quality of video is actually pretty impressive. So uh, I'm going to see if I can doctor it a little bit because it kind of washes me out just a little bit. But based off of that lighting uh that's kind of like stage lighting with tan on and i'm surprisingly happy with how things are looking in the right lighting uh so that makes me feel really good i weighed in 241 today so uh to think that i was gonna cut 40 pounds to get on stage um very interested to see uh what i look like at 230 and then go from there uh, we're about 10 pounds down. We've gotten to 240. We've gotten to 239, I think. Uh, and then we just kind of bumped back up because I wasn't paying attention to my carbs. Uh, and we also ate out a couple times. So being cognizant of that moving forward, uh, we're very excited to see uh, how this season's going to go. I mean, really, it's just me getting back into the, getting back into bodybuilding and weight training. Uh, with this move here, it's been tough. Uh, we weren't able to do a lot of the stuff that we wanted to do, uh, especially with the five or six days of travel. And then now um, I kind of was just making an excuse for myself with the injuries, with the shoulder labrum here. You can see it's all always jacked up. And then with my foot. Um, also, the gyms were closed. So kind of, I don't know. I don't know. It was kind of a, a awakening for me trying to like figure out myself. Um, but I'm very excited to see where this season takes us. Uh, we have lots of time to put on muscle and get lean. Uh, so we're just going to keep going. So if you have recommendations for movements that you really, really enjoy that work with a torn labrum, that work with a torn labrum, um, I'd love to hear about it. And um, with the foot, if you have any exercises to help with the foot, uh, the so like right in this piece of the foot, is super activated. So when I'm running, it's like a club foot. It doesn't flex well. Same with squatting, um, the whole right leg. I woke up this morning, my left leg, the glute, everything was just destroyed from legs yesterday. But um, my right my right glute, my right leg, nothing, not even sore. So uh, always appreciate recommendations as always. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's um, it's really nice to talk to you guys. I, I missed making these videos. So uh, expect more raw footage, not really edited footage of me just talking to you guys and um, just syncing up. So if you guys want to see any like lives or anything, let me know. If you want me to talk about specific topics, let me know. All right. But, but that's it, guys. Uh, thanks so much for watching. My name is Sanj, and I'll see you guys in the next one.